Hey, good day. Welcome to my first Q&A segment. I want to take an episode of I Love Lucy and put ourselves in that same situation and ask the question, how would you handle it? And I'm talking about season one, episode one. That is, if after you ignore the pilot episode, I speak of the episode, The Girls Want to Go to a Nightclub. How did the Ricardos and the Mertzes stay as friends? In so many episodes, I asked myself this question. Okay, outside of the obvious of the show, but could I have friends or stay married after going through some of the events they did? So it occurred to me to ask you, how would you handle it? As a kid growing up on I Love Lucy reruns, Reruns, mind you, sloppily edited to fit commercial sponsors, by the way. Man, was I happy when DVDs came out on the show. It was like watching the show for the first time. Seeing the full content clips I never saw on television. In these Q&A segments, what I want to do is something I've wondered as a child when watching the show. I love Lucy. Now... I know television shows and writers have to produce conflicts, but I have wondered how these couples stayed friends. If in real life, this segment is intended to hear how you would react if placed in the same situation. From time to time, I will put together one of these segments to I Love Lucy and other shows to ask you, the fan, and viewer your opinion and or reactions if these took place in your life this is all in fun so let's begin this is Fred and Ethel's anniversary Fred wants to go to the fights and the girls want to go to a nightclub in your opinion which should they go to the fights or a nightclub whose choice should win how could they have worked this out but more importantly, I ask, what if this were happening to you and your partner? What would you expect or do? It would be fun to read your answers to any one or all of these questions. So come on, don't be shy. Give us your thoughts on these. Do the men have any right to pick where to go for an anniversary more or less over the women? My answer might be that the women and men agree to do both, but on different nights or days. It is tradition for the males to treat the love of their life to an event, but the anniversary is of the couple. So why can't tradition be changed to include a treat for the men? Give us your answer in the comment section and please keep this civil. Remember, this is fun and to hear other people's thoughts. Thank you. And guess what? I'll see you in the next one.